Hello friends, this is Digi Vakam and thank you for joining interview points. So in this video, I am going to talk about how to validate an email. Okay, so now let's get started. Before going to start this video, if you haven't subscribed my YouTube channel, then please subscribe my YouTube channel. Here you will get all the playlists. See, this is a validation for applicant Python tutorial, ASP.NET and MVC tutorial. You can watch anything. Okay, so now let's get started. So this is the email field. So I want this is the validation for the email field. so what i want i want to create an event for the so i need to create an event leaf so this is the leaf just double click on it so first of all i need to create a function void okay so i am going to delete this function okay guys for regular regular express i need to use one namespace here so for that we need to use a namespace system dot text dot dot regular expression okay. so this is the namespace that i need to use so for that i need to use a regular expression so i have written the code so simple code so this is the so it is little bit lengthy that's why i have written this so before that i want to put one condition here ext email dot length greater than zero at that time okay sorry it is the length text length greater than zero at that time uh, i want to validate dot text sorry text dot dot length so now uh, put this regular expression after that i need to write one condition here if not r is x email dot is match txt this is a text box dot text i want to do anything else okay after that what i want to do i want to give one message message dot so please provide a valid email okay do put comma here so after that what i want here i want to focus this txt dot focus this is Okay. after that return okay. so now so this email validation function i want to call after leave. when i will leave that event so now run this see this is the email because i am right uh, i am entering here so this is i have mouse enter okay mouse leave so email is not valid please provide a valid email but it is also not valid so now i'm clicking on the tab you can see again proper message so if i will use here at now it is also not valid so you can see here valid is message gmail but i haven't put any dot dot so if i will leave you can see the validation message if i will put put dot here it is now validate so now you can see you can move anywhere okay but this email is not valid you can you cannot so it is allowing us you can see okay so this is the validation for email thank you guys for watching this video hope you enjoy this video and if you have any question related to any any validation you can ask through comment i will respond to you and i will get some time okay so thank you guys i hope good luck and see you in the next video